hello everyone you are welcome to math explorer in this video i'm going to solve and find the value of this nice simplification math problem that is 2 raised to power 25 minus 2 raised to power 24 minus 2 raised to power 2 now what we will do here here first of all we will change this 25 to the sum of 24 plus 1 so this equation will become is equal to 2 raised to power 25 can be written as 24 plus 1 minus 2 raised to power 24 minus 2 raised to power 2. Now here in this one term 2 raised to power 24 plus 1 we will use an exponential math property in exponential identity. So here we will use this one identity r raised to power m plus n can also be written as r raised to power m times r raised to power n. So using this exponential identity here in this one term this equation will become is equal to this will become 2 raised to power 24 times 2 raised to power 1 so 2 raised to power 1 is 2 minus 2 raised to power 24 minus 2 raised to power 2. Now here from these two terms we will take 2 raised to power 24 common. So this equation will become taking 2 raised to power 24 common. So here 2 is left minus here only 1 is left minus 2 raised to power 2. Now what is the value of 2 minus 1? 2 minus 1 is 2. So this will become 2 raised to power 24 times 1. No, any number times 1 is the same number. So, this will become 2 raised to power 24 minus 2 raised to power 2. Now, here we will factorize this number to the product of 12 times 2. So this will become, we can write 24 as 12 times 2 minus 2 raised to power 2. Now, again here in this one term, we will use an exponential math property. So here in this term we will use this one exponential math property r s to power m times n can also be written as r s to power m whole s to power n. So using this identity in this first one term this equation will become is equal to this will become 2 raised to power 12 whole s to power 2 minus 2 raised to power 2. Now how can we solve this equation further? There are two methods, two approaches to solve this equation further. One is to use the algebraic identity a square minus b square which I use mostly most of the times in my previous videos. And the second approach is to find the value of 2 raised to power 12 and then here in this one term you use a plus b whole square identity. So here I will use the second one approach, second one method. So first I will find the value of 2 raised to power 12. So therefore the value of 2 raised to power 12 is 2 raised to power 12 is same as 2 raised to power 2 times 2 raised to power 10. Now 2 raised to power 2 is simply 4 times and 2 raised to power 10 is a very famous number that is 1024 1, we, will, we will multiply these two numbers so 4 times power is 16 6 1 will be carried 4 times 2 is 8 8 plus 1 is 9 4 times 0 is 0 and 4 times 1 is 4 so the product of these two numbers gives him 4096 so the value of 2 raised to power 12 is 4096 so here we will replace 2 raised to power 12 with this one value so this equation will become 2 raised to power 12 is 4096 whole square minus 2 square. Now here I will change this number to the sum of 4000 plus 96. So this will become this number can be written as 4000 plus 96 whole square minus 2 square. Now here in this one term I will use a positive algebraic identity. So here I will use this one identity in this one term. A plus B whole square is equal to 
a square plus b square plus 2 times a b so using this algebraic identity this equation will become here 4000 is a and 96 is b so this will become is equal to no a square a is 4000 square plus b square b is 96 square plus 2 times a b so a is 4000 and b is 96 minus 2 raised to power 2 is 4 now we will find out the value inside the braces so this will become 4000 square is 4 square is 16 so this will become 16 million no 96 square is we will find the value of 96 square here so 96 times 96 is 6 times 6 is 36 6 3 will be carried no 9 times 6 is 54 54 plus 3 is 57 no 9 times 6 is 54 4 5 will be carried 9 times 9 is 81 81 plus 5 is 86 so this will give him 6 this will become 11 1 1 will become here 5 plus 1 is 6 6 plus 6 is 12 2 1 will become here 8 plus 1 is 9 so the 96 square is 9216 so the value of 96 square is 9216 plus now we will find this value so 2 times 4000 is 8000 and 8000 9 times 96 is now we will find this value here so we will multiply 8000 with 96 96 times 0 is 0 96 times 0 is 0 96 times 0 is 0 no 8 times 6 is 48 so 8 4 will be carried no 8 times 9 is 72 72 plus 4 is 76 so this gives him 786000 so this will become the product of these three numbers is 768 minus 4 now we will add up these three numbers and then finally we will subtract 4 from the answer so let us add these three numbers so we will start from the ones position 0 plus 6 plus 0 is 6 no, 0 plus 1 plus 0 is 1 0 plus 2 plus 0 is 2 comma 8 plus 9 is 17 so 7 1 will be carried to the next number so 6 plus 1 is 7 7 plus 0 is 7 no there is 7 so 7 plus 0 is 7 comma 16 so the sum of these three numbers gives him 16 million 777216 minus 4 so finally we will subtract this 4 from the ones digit so this will give him our final answer so our final answer will become 16 million 777,206 minus 4 gives him 2. So finally, 16,777,200 and 10 is our answer. And value of this nice simplification math problem. And last, if you like this video, so don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.